In the last video, we talked about pointillism. Pointillism is a technique created in the 1800s where artists will use very tiny dots close together to form a painting. Today, we'll be talking about impersonism, also created by French artists that was also in the 1800s. The pioneer of the impersonism art movement is Vincent van Gogh. He was one of the first people to do this. Impressionism are paintings that capture ordinary scenes, such as landscapes or people walking outside, and they are characterized by quick brushstrokes and very subtle dabs of paint. So let's get started. To start off with, much like pointillism, you're going to want to start with a base coat. Once again, we're going to be doing a light blue, and we can mix as we go in this case. So I will start off with a little bit of white. Get some white on the tip of your brush, and you're gonna do just tiny little dabs. And you're gonna make circular motions all throughout. Tiny little dabs, circular motions all throughout. You can go ahead and do that on top of the snow too, just tiny, very short brush strokes. All right, anywhere you have shadow. Next, we're gonna take a darker color. You can do purple or you can do blue. The choice is yours. tiny short little marks just like that where the shadow will be adding where you think you'll have shadow you can put tiny little marks notice how I'm not doing this that's not how we do that that's regular painting you want to add little tiny brush strokes unlike the point laser we do points you're doing short horizontal lines close together. While that's still wet, you're going to get some white and paint on top of the white, just like that. In a nutshell, that is Impressionism. We do this over and over again to get that kind of Impressionistic technique. Monet was also an Impressionism artist. And towards the end of his life, he was blind. And that's kind of why he started to paint like this, because he had a hard time seeing the light and the figures. And so when he was, he was literally drawing what he saw when he painted this style. We're gonna move on to the tree and let that dry. With the tree, you're gonna start off with some yellow. And again, make tiny strokes. Then we're gonna get some blue. And put tiny strokes on top. some more yellow the key with the person in your art is you see every single brush stroke you don't blend the key this year is regular blending you don't want to do that you want to see every single individual brush stroke as you go and don't mix your colors on your palette just let the paintbrush do all the work
very short and quick. That one's done. I'm gonna go back to the snow now. Again, very short, little brush strokes. For the sky, same thing, except we'll be doing swirls like Vincent Van Gogh. And you mix as you go. The key to doing this is that your brush is not too wet. I have not once wet my brush, except maybe once to wash it. That is the gist of it. It's not finished by any means, but it's good enough for this now. To recap, pointillism is a technique. Both, both techniques were created in the 1800s by different artists. This was created by Vincent Van Gogh. This one was created by Georges Seurat. With, they each had their own technique. Georges Seurat will use very tiny dots close together to give the illusion of color that they go together. Vincent Van Gogh also created this technique in the 1800s. It is called Impressionism. We use very tiny strokes and depth of paint together to suggest how something might look at a distance. Impressionism artists really focus on how light would, how light related to different subjects during times of day. The snowman might look different if it was during the day versus at night, and they will focus on the shadows and the highlights.